There is a resolution filed by some yes. lawmakers yeah. asking the government to cooperate with ICC para yes. ma-push through daw yung probe. Uh, what do you think of this, sir? Well, it, this? Uh, uh, the, this is not uh, unusual, but uh, it's really a sense of the House resolution. Uh, and it's this, uh, the sense they are just a, they are just uh, uh, expressing or manifesting uh, the sense of the house that perhaps it's time to uh, allow or to cooperate with the ICC investigations. Uh, but uh, there, as I as I have always said, there are still some problems in terms of uh, uh, jurisdiction and sovereignty. Now, if you can solve those problems, then that would be something else. But it's uh, fundamental yung mga, yung mga question na ganun eh. Because if you're talking about the sovereign uh, jurisdiction of the ICC, especially since we have withdrawn uh, from the Rome Statutes a few years back, uh, that brings into question whether or not this is actually possible. Uh, there is also a question, should we return? Uh, under the fold of the ICC. So that's again under study. So we'll just keep looking at it and uh, see what our, what our options are. Uh, I, I, simple lang para sa akin, simple lang naman yung issue yan eh. Hindi naman siguro tama na ang mga tigalabas, mga dayuhan, uh, magsasabi sa atin kung sino iimbestigahan ng pulis natin, sinong aarestuhin ng pulis natin, sinong ikukulong ng pulis natin. Hindi naman, dapat tam hindi naman siguro tama yun. Uh, dapat Pilipino lang ang gumagawa niyan. May pulis naman tayo, eh. may NBI naman tayo, may DOJ tayo. Eh, kaya nila yung trabaho niyan. And that's really where the conflict is.